Did you have a sign on the set that said you will get wet? <laughs> and you know what? I, the, the spaces were so tight in the tanks that we built that there was no room for a director to even get in there. I've always been in the water for whether it's a large tank or the deep or the actual open ocean uh, on the movies that I've directed. And in this one, uh, you know, I, 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 uh, I, I wasn't, I was at the monitor. Often I was actually balancing two units, the water unit and the dialogue production unit at the same time with monitors going. So it was, uh, it was dense, but it wasn't about me getting wet. It was, a, but I was concerned about the actors because they committed to doing all the diving themselves, which was great. And it was, you know, I was told it was safe and, uh, and it, it gave me all kinds of opportunities to create suspense and drama and really connect the characters to those caves. But, uh, it, but it, it, you know, it, it later, even though I kept asking them, you know, how's it going? Is it all right? And it was all, yeah, Ron, we're okay. Later, I found out they'd all had like panic attacks or, you know, moments of real anxiety in the midst of it. It was tight, tight quarters. I, I would have it. I'm telling you that right now. With this kind of story, though, how did you decide that you were going to do it as a feature and not as a documentary? Because you've done a lot of documentaries lately. Well, there were already documentaries that had been made and were in the process of being made. And so in my mind, um, sort of my my mandate was to take this story. I look, I think all the all the versions are valid. This is an amazing story and it needs to be it deserves to be and looked at, understood and appreciated over and over again in whatever format. But I felt like our job with to, in a movie version with world class actors was to to really do that other thing in dramatizing it with honesty and and in, in the information and in the details, but create that kind of dramatic empathy that um, that with an audience, that connection with what what really did it feel like to be there? Not just what happened, um, but but what would it have been like to be there alongside those parents, alongside those dialogues? You do feel that. Did you have trouble communicating with then Asian actors or was that? I Well, I had a lot of help. I had two co-producers who were Thai who initially began working on the film to help with our, our translation and make sure that it, it wasn't just some sort of academic translation. It was real dialogue. But it went so much further because they began to share with me nuances and details of Thai culture that weren't necessarily reflected in a script written by a Westerner, you know. And sure. then I began to engage with the with the actors themselves. Some spoke a lot of English, some none. And, and so between the interpreters, our, my co-producers and the actors themselves and our cinematographer, Sayampu Mukti Prom, who's a world class cinematographer, who's Thai, uh, you know, I had layers of uh of um of sort of um uh of supervision you know in this regard one last question though with your own you did a book with your brother would you ever turn that into a movie <laughs> i don't know if there's a movie story there because thank god and i'm knocking on wood right now they're not not quite enough drama to 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 carry a movie narrative thank thank you i'm glad uh, <laughs> uh you know i'm grateful for that um, but, um, but it's been great, the, very gratifying, the response that, that people have had to the, uh, to the book. And maybe, maybe someday Clint or I will see a, you know, a movie narrative or a TV series in there. Who knows? You'll pull a Spielberg and do the, the Fableman, right? <laughs> I love the Fablemans. I thought it was just great, by the way. I did too. Hey, thank you so much. And this is wonderful. So thank you for doing the film. Yeah, my pleasure. Thank you. Great talking to you.